How's it going, guys? Thank you guys so much for joining me today. We got to talk. Do you want to know why real estate is so hard? Because we're not building that trust. Let's talk about it. Real estate is so hard because so many people have screwed it up. Real estate is difficult because there's been so many people that lacked what they should have. Before I got into this game, people just don't trust realtors. So what you have to do as an agent to make this just a little bit easier on yourself is be trusting, be honest, be upfront. Even though I'm an upfront agent, I don't allow like any necessarily, you know, to, to be disrespectful or to have any form of negative approach towards my business. It's always for the best interest of you. It's always for the best for your situation. I'm not going to try and manipulate or, you know, we got to be straight up with this. If you want to get in the house, we got to make sure all the ducks are in a row. So why is it hard to be a real estate agent is simple because of the people before didn't take the full responsibility that it takes to be a real estate agent. But I'm here to make a difference. I'm here to make a change. And what I mean by that is I'm going to handle my business with honesty, integrity, and straight up devotion to you and getting you what it is that you're looking for in real estate. If you're looking to sell, we're going to get you the highest value. If you're looking to buy, I'm going to try and find you the best deal. But in this market, we also have to understand that it is a seller's market. And that's what I do to explain to my clients. So I believe real estate is as hard as you make it. Real estate is as hard as you, you put on yourself. Me every day, there's a strategic plan. There's a strategic system on how I go about my business. That is just that simple. Why is it so hard to be a real estate agent? Because people don't trust you. People don't know you. So you have to make things different. You have to get out there and say, hey, I'm sorry, the person that helped you sell your home or the person that helped you before, regardless of whether they're looking to buy or sell, basically the person before you screwed up. So you have a distrust in realtors, but I'm here to say, hey, you can trust me. You could believe in me. You could depend on me to go above and beyond and to find you the result that you're looking for in real estate. And if right now that result is not attainable, I'm going to tell you that. I'm going to be completely honest and tell you, hey, we just don't have enough funds. We're FHA, but the conventional loans are killing right now. So if we can't get conventional, I think we should take some time. We should be more patient and wait for those FHAs to start being stronger. So guys, don't make it hard on yourself. I genuinely feel like real estate is what you make out of it. I did medical claims. I was a customer service representative for Blue Shield of California, and I did medical claims, medical bills, procedure codes, thousands of dollars. People are getting charged to our, I mean, uh, our, our insurance was getting charged. So this, that's... <laughs> Real estate is far more easier than medical claims. Okay, I, I maybe I just, I, I don't know. You've had jobs before, I'm gonna tell you, this job is far more easier than most physical labor jobs, customer service jobs for sure, because that's what you do. You're in the business of customer service. Your service is just guiding them in real estate. So don't make it hard on yourself. Be happy about helping. Be happy about being in a position that allows flexibility. As a real estate agent, you're not always fucking working. Most of us do a lot of things from home because we can. I, I'm only in this office doing my videos because it just looks more professional on the real estate side. So don't make things harder for yourself. But I mean, any successful person in real estate will tell you that it's what you make out of it. It's that simple. It's what you make out of it. I said, when I'm going to get into this business, I'm just not going to quit. You only fail when you quit. 
So I just keep, every time, this don't work, I try something different. This don't work, I try something different. And just keep trying until I find my system, until I find exactly what works. I'm just, I just can't stop. And that's why I'm not going to say real estate is easy, it's smoother for me. Because I'm here to take what's difficult for my clients and put it on myself. So I'm not going to say, oh, it's all unicorns and rainbows. I'm not going to say that because it's not. But what it is, taking a difficult situation or something that can be difficult and making it as smooth as possible for your clients. So real estate, man, is it's not hard. It's not just this, you know, completely difficult thing. I do this full time. So if you have a job on top of this, I can only imagine. But I enjoy helping people. That's what makes this easy. There's nothing that I don't do that I don't enjoy. I enjoy doing these videos. I enjoy making this content. I got two videos locked and loaded, ready to go. Go about to go home, pick up some lunch, get these videos edited so that for the rest of the week, I got videos dropping because I love to do it. While my videos are dropping, I'm calling, I'm on the phone. Hey, how's it going? Are you looking to buy or sell? Hey, it's Derek Swain Jr. Hey, I'm putting myself out there while my social media and everything is already out there. So why is real estate so hard? Because you make it that way, okay? It's because you keep putting the pressures on yourself. When you just gotta get up every day, be thankful and put yourself out there. Please, let's go put ourselves out there. I'm gonna put myself out there today. I got an ad coming, I just finished, it took a while. Not me just finished, but the person I was working with, we had a lot of things to, you know, I, I have a vision for things and I wanna make sure my vision comes out how I see it. And we did just that. I was blessed to give, give the work to the guy. He, and he put my vision how I wanted it and it's beautiful. So I got my website coming. I got new ads about to be dropped and see what business comes from that. And that's just what it is. Keep creating, keep putting yourselves in positions to be successful. And if it don't work, try something else. Try something different. For me, man, I was doing these cold calls and that shit is not easy. You're gonna get more disappointment than you're gonna get an appointment. So make sure you have different avenues to get out there. Cold calling has became so much easier because I'm not stressed about that's the only part of my business to get business. I got ads, I got my YouTube, I got Instagram, Facebook, everything just pumping, doing something to get me to where I ultimately wanna be, which is the dopest real estate agent in California. And I'm already on my way. Guys, it's just that simple. Real estate is as hard as you make it. So don't do shit you don't wanna do, it's okay. We are the generation of information. So if there's something you don't wanna do, for example, cold calls, look for different avenues and ways to get business so you don't have to cold call. It's that simple. Real estate is as hard as you make it. You just keep peeling back these layers, keep figuring it out, keep working it out, keep trying these different things and soon, it's gonna come. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you guys subscribe. Make sure you guys ring that bell so you get a notification every time that I upload. And you know I'm here to guide you through all your real estate complications. We gonna get it done and we gonna get to where we wanna go. It's just that simple. Take it easy.